On the side that goes towards St. Mark's District, near the bridge, you can see a large building with a crenellated roof called Fondaco de Tedeschi, which you probably already noticed from a Vaporetto. The Fondaco, or warehouse, was in fact a kind of chamber of commerce, where the important merchant community of Germanic residents gathered in Venice. At the beginning of the 1500s, it was half destroyed by fire but rebuilt soon after in a much more grandiose fashion with offices, warehouses, and retail space, partially referencing the traditional appearances of the Venetian trading fondaci since the Byzantine era. Unfortunately, you can no longer see the exterior decorations of the early 1500s that had been entrusted to Giorgione and Titian. Only a few traces remain and are preserved at Ca d'Oro. For this reason, the palace may seem a bit bare, on the opposite side, the stairs of the bridge will lead you into a bustling market area at the entrance to the San Polo district. The area was arranged with long wings of 16th century porticos. The so-called old factories where even today you can see shops and stalls with the characteristic white awnings. As you'll notice, the market is crowded at all hours, but with different crowds. In the early morning, the Venetians will go shopping there. In the middle of the day, it's full of tourists heading to the Basilica of the Frari, while in the evening, it becomes an obligatory point for anyone enjoying Venice's nightlife thanks to the many clubs in the area, the typical Bacari, Venetian popular bars, and the restaurants overlooking the Grand Canal. Fun Fact One of the Rialto Market's landmarks, which will surely fascinate you, is the curious church preceded by a portico called San Giacomo di Rialto or more popularly, San Giacometto. You may have already seen it in the works of the great painters of the 17th century, from Guardi to Canaletto. Yet looking at it today, after the many renovations it has undergone, you'll find it hard to recognize it as the oldest church in Venice, founded nearly 1,700 years ago. Or at least, that's what the legend says. And with this, we have finished our tour of the Rialto Bridge. My Wo Wo thanks you for staying with us, and we'll see you at the next Wonder of the World.